Well, this last weekend was a big one for our family. We wrapped up spring soccer season. And you may recall from another two-minute tip that I coached my six-year-old daughter's team this year, a group of kindergartners, and they were such an amazing group. We came in second place in the end-of-season tournament. I have to admit that competitive side of me really wanted us to win, but second place was awesome, and the girls did an amazing job. Well, every single game this season at halftime, I huddled the girls up and I asked them two questions. What are you doing really well out there that you want to keep doing in the second half? And the second question was, and what do you want to do differently? Is there something new you want to try, something that you want to shift? Very simple. All hands would go up every single time. They would each have something to share in response. It is so powerful for us to pause and actually reflect on what's going on and pivot with heightened awareness. But we rarely do this. We move so fast that we don't pause to reflect. I love the quote from John Dewey that says, we don't learn from experience. We learn from reflecting on experience. I want today's tip to be all about giving you a couple questions to enhance some reflection, reflecting on your current experience. And the first part of the challenge is for you to spend time in individual reflection. The second part of the challenge is for you to go share what you learned through that reflection with somebody else. Okay, here are your three questions. One, what is one thing that you are proud of from the last week? Two, what's something new that you have been trying in your leadership or in the way that you approach your work? How is it going and what are you learning through it? And then the third question is, what is one thing that you are currently doing regularly that's not serving you well? And how do you want to pivot away from that? That's it. Simple. The power comes from you spending time reflecting on those questions, just like my soccer team did at halftime with all hands up, all in on that reflection. I hope that you will do the same, be all in on that reflection and learning and go share it with somebody else because that will absolutely heighten the learning and the application thereafter.